Hello everyone, and welcome to another video about Blockonomics. In this video, we're going to be looking at how to create a P2S at Segwit wallet using Electron. With Segwit wallets, you can save on transaction fee and decrease the overhead on the Bitcoin network, which will in turn help in getting your transactions confirmed quicker. Also, this wallet can interact with all the current versions of Bitcoin clients so you can receive money from anyone and also get the benefits of Segwit. So let's get started. To download the Electron wallet, you head over to electron.org and on the home page, you click on the download button, which is at the top bar. So on this page, you're going to see a couple of options and based on your operating system, just go ahead and download the relevant installer. In our case, we're going to be using the Windows installer since we're on Windows. Okay, so once your wallet is successfully installed, you can go ahead and start it. And this is the first page that you will be seeing. So the first thing that the wallet asks is for its name. So by default, the name given to the wallet is default wallet. At this stage, we don't really need this name. So we just let it stay the way it is and we move on to the next step. In this next step, we let it stay at standard wallet. Click on next. Uh, we let it stay at create a new seed and click on next. Over here in the seed type, we choose legacy and we click on next. And now we get our wallet seed. So uh, I would suggest that you save this wallet seed somewhere private and safe as this is basically the key to your wallet. So once you have noted this down somewhere, we are going to go ahead and close our wallet and then restart it. Once you have restarted the wallet, this is the page that you're going to see. You would be redirected back to the first page. And over here, now you can go ahead and type the wallet name, whatever preferred name that you want for your wallet, just go ahead and type that here. We are going to use separate wallet as our wallet name, and we're gonna click on next. We let it stay at standard wallet and click on next. Now in this step, we go ahead and choose, I already have a seed because we noted down a seed in the previous step, and we click on next. And the seed that we noted down in the previous step, that's what we're going to be entering over here. Okay, so we have now inserted the wallet seed that we noted in the previous step. Once that's done, we click on options and select BIP39 seed. And we click on okay. There's going to be a little bit of a warning sign that pops up here, but we can just go ahead and ignore that and click on next. In this step, we select the second option here, which says P2S at SegWit, because that's the type of wallet we're trying to create, and we click on next. Over here, we select a strong password for our wallet. So I'm just gonna go ahead and type down a password for the wallet. And click on next. So there we go. Our P2S at SegWit wallet has successfully been created on Electrum. To check that is in fact a P2S at SegWit wallet, we can do it by two ways. You can check the receive addresses and see that they start with a three, or you can head over to wallet information, and then in the script type, it's would say P2S over here. So there we go. We have successfully created our Bitcoin wallet. Now you can go ahead and start receiving Bitcoins and at the same time, enjoy all the benefits of SegWit. Thanks a lot for watching and hope to see you soon.